Hi, welcome back to Art of Stories. So today we are going to tell you about parrot astrology and tarot card. It seems like my mumkin is ready with this story. She also have a love for macaw parrots. So today I am also going to show you how to make a macaw parrot with some glitter papers. Let's get started. <laughs> These glitter papers are basically scrap for me. I bought this last year for my baby's birthday decoration. And these are the leftovers. I am going to make this macaw parrot with the red, blue and greens available in this glitter paper. This is the parrot in which we are going to do mosaic art. And I have just drawn the outline of it. Now let's draw some guiding line throughout the parrot so that we can get an idea where we have to stick the paper of different colors. To get a natural feathery look, I am also going to intersect colors in between so that it won't look like a section of red, blue and green. For mosaic art which we are doing now is traditionally done with tiles, glass, mosaic, stones and shells. These are patterns or image made of small regular or irregular pieces. You can see an example of mosaic art in church, synagogues, cathedrals or mosque. Now in the digital world, these kind of artists can also be visible in Photoshop or photo editing apps. You can try yourself with color papers or paper from magazine or comic books. It's just that it has to be the shade of color you need for whatever image you are creating. Now I will be taking you to the world of parrot astrology and will also tell you a little bit about tarot cards which is very similar to parrot astrology. If you are from southern part of India, you might have seen people carrying a parrot in cage and approaching the public claiming that they can tell your future. This is parrot astrology or parrot card. Is a type of astrology popular among south part of India and Singapore. It became famous in Singapore because of the Indian community spread in the place known as Little India. Parrots from the breed parakeets are trained to pick up the fortune cards. For my friends who have never seen a parrot astrology, let me tell you the process. First they will lay the cards in front of the customer and he would open the cage and ask his parrot to come out and he will feed the parrot with some nut or fruit and ask it to choose any one card from the bunch of 27 cards. And from that picked card, the astrologer will predict the future of the customer. This card contains images of Hindu god and goddesses. Some card contains images of Buddha or Virgin Mary with infant Jesus. So why parrots? As per beliefs, parrots are considered holy. And in Hindu mythology, they have represented vehicle of Hindu god Kamdeva and also found on the right hand of goddesses Meenakshi, also known as goddesses Parvati. But the only scientific explanation for parrots being associated with astrology is the quality of their hypervision, because of which they have profound instinct to predict future occasions like earthquake or incident similar like that. When they feel these troubles, they leave the place. Because of this parrot are considered sharp, which is essential key to parrot crystal gazing. Nowadays, the popularity of parrot astrology has diminished. So maybe because of that, they have also shifted their services online. And in recent times, many animal rights activists have opposed this practice of clipping wings of birds and caging them. But the very similar practice of parrot astrology one can relate is with tarot card, which instead of parrot, the card reader itself picked the cards. Tarot card contains of 78 cards which can be split into two main groups Major Arcana and Minor Arcana Arcana is an Italian word for which the English meaning is secret and these cards represent four elements that is air, earth, water and fire Tarot card was invented in Italy in 1430s but they are used around the world now and also said that they have an influence of ancient Egypt, Iran and Indian Tantrams. 
though today it is associated with astrology and future telling but at first tarot cards were originally just another card game in part of europe if you see old tarot cards you will find similar figures as a playing card it was jean baptiste who first assigned a specific order and spread the card both forward and backward a system which is still used today before starting the card game he was the first person to be a professional tarot reader these cards were modified many times and now the form of card is different from the old version psychologist card jug explained that the cards are easy way to represent the universal traits like strength ambition and passion making them ideal tool for therapy and mental health unlike parrot astrology which is carried forward by family passed on to another family members tarot cards are for everyone because the concept is everybody has an intuition tarot is a way to connect to that so that is the only scientific explanation for a tarot card reading now let's see how the card is read it is believed that tar- tarot card tells you the answer for some questions you have and it shows the past present and future so the deck is mainly spread into three part if need more clarification over your question it can be further divided into five portion after that the person should think about the question open your eyes and pick one card from each spread and this will help you to interpret the answer by the symbol present in the card these cards have various themes so you will surely get a relatable answer to your queries so don't you think the psychological science explained before is correct tarot act as a medium to connect with the subconscious mind to solve certain issues but as per spiritual explanation tarot cards are magical and the energy of the person is transferred to the card while shuffling you might believe in energy or chalk to it up to entertainment but tarots are fun the topic of tarot cards is very wide with the varieties of cards and symbols and the way you can interpret it which is a different topic altogether so hopefully i will cover it in some other video so this is our final macao parrot i couldn't capture the real beauty of this parrot in the picture because different light setting is giving different shades i hope you like this video if you did please do not forget to like share and subscribe to art of stories